put me against anyone, I am comfortable going back and forth with them. Oh, but you don't say. No, I'm really comfortable going back and forth with whoever. So we, we're calling the people. If you want to come and, no, no, you know, battle the myth. We found out together that his grandmother made my mother's wedding gown. What? <laughs> Like that's that's how that's how legendary. Yeah, it's amazing for a woman to just have real male friends. Facts, <laughs> big facts. VIP access with Aniko is today coming to you live and direct from Kampala, Uganda. Very honored to be back. Thank you very much, Speak Apartments at Kitante, for hosting us. So I wouldn't be here and not talk to some of the people I dig the most from this city. And uh, the reason why I decided to talk to this person is because when it comes to hip-hop and UG, he knows it all. Welcoming none other than the myth. Hey. Hey. <laughs> well gone. My guy, what's up? I'm good, how are you? Good. In a while. I know. She forgot about us. <laughs> never. I could never forget about you. And I just want you to officially become my hug buddy. <laughs> no, I'm a gangster. <laughs> That's exactly how not to approach a hip-hop artist by asking them to be your hug buddy. But hey, I love your hugs. How have you been? I've been good. I've been good. How have you been? I've been well, thank you. Congratulations. I'm saying For what? Congratulations. For what? This, for <laughs> jumping off the plank. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. And thank you so much for always supporting me. It's amazing for a woman to just have real male friends. Yeah, I will say that. Facts. A lot of people in the industry obviously got introduced to the myth through Clear Cut. And um, I just know that Navio was part of Clear Cut. Could you please tell me about the other members? Where are they now? And... How, how long was Clear Cut in the game and what's, what's up now? Okay. Aside from myself and Navio, uh, there's JB, who is in Canada. Uh, Papito, who's actually in, just next door, he's in Dar es Salaam. Um, and Langman, who is in Germany. Uh, right now, I don't know if I can say much about what we're doing, but we're doing, we're doing some stuff. There's some stuff uh, bubbling that we're working on. We're always recording. Soon people will get to enjoy what, what, what we're working on. Fantastic. So for those watching and don't know uh, who ClearCut or what ClearCut was, I would say that ClearCut is one of the groups um, of hip-hop in UG that actually paved way for many others and were pioneers of sort. And it was not just the group, but it's the style and the delivery, you know, the albums you guys produced. So um, how many albums do you guys have? Three albums. Uh, ClearCut, the first one was Mind, Body and Soul. Uh, the second was K-Squared. The third was Clear Discussion, which featured us working with an um, uh, incredible uh, traditional group here in Uganda. So it, it was a fusion of hip-hop and traditional, uh, our Ugandan traditional drums, uh, percussion, discussion, Africa. So the, I, I think aside from, apart from uh, this, the second album, uh, K-Squared, all the other albums are Cora nominated and just nominated across the continent. And they, they pretty much put us, kick the door down for us in the region and then further ahead and kick the door down for us continentally and, you know, worldwide and everything. Yeah. What really happened that you guys are not together anymore? Because I think some people always think like maybe you're not in good times or you broke up, but I think life also happens. Yeah, it's, it's, it, that's really it. But then mostly um, we just had to study. <laughs> we were kids. We were kids when we started out. We just, but then, aside from that, it's these are the f like I said, these are the first people who hear my solo music. I hear their solo music first before anyone else. The the one thing that we've always had is when it's time to record, leave your ego the other side. Don't come and tell me I'm Navio. I'm the myth. No, 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 no. I'm J. No, 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 no. no. You leave that outside. Yeah. Let's get in studio. Let's work. That's okay. always been the first thing that we're trying to push. Okay. Music first. Okay. Yeah. I'm actually in awe um, when I look at you and Navio because you have a very strong, um, I would say, friendship mm -hmm. and you've always kind of remained as long-term collaborators. Yeah. And I actually had somewhere today that you guys met even before ClearCut. So could you just tell me how way back you go with Navio? Him and I met in when ClearCut was starting. Okay. But our families... Our families met way before. I, we found out together 
that his grandmother made my mother's wedding gown. <laughs> what? <laughs> and she's telling us that we're like, eh? <laughs> no, no, no clue. But our families have always been close. Wow. You know, but I mean, it's, it's just something that, uh, the reason we collaborate a lot together is how do we keep the clear cut name going forward? It's the foundation of what we have built. I also feel like despite the fact that you guys collaborate a lot, Navio took a different path from the path you took and probably because you're, you're both independent you know, artists mm. in your own right as well. Yeah. And um, in the recent past, Navio has been releasing some songs which are not purely hip-hop and I, yeah. I feel like you've al almost kept it strictly hip-hop. Yeah. So tell me about that. In a group you have, yeah, we're, we're five people but each of us has a different personality. Yeah. I always wanted to be the nicest MC, point blank period. That's it, that's where I want to be, I'm comfortable there. Put me against anyone, I am comfortable going back and forth with them. Um, now well, but you don't say. No, I'm really comfortable going back and forth with who So we, we're calling the people, if you wanna come and no, no, you know, battle the relax, meat. Relax, <laughs> relax okay. <laughs> he has always been very musical. I think that's also with his upbringing because he liked, he liked um, I think he was in a choir, in a church choir. Me in church, I was always the kid who was just running around. But yeah, you know, so he has always had that with him. So whenever he, he listens to music, he thinks of it different ways. He's thinking what melodies could be added, what instrumentation could be added. I'm just thinking how many bars can I, <laughs> can I execute on this, which words and all that. So it's, it's just really that. Papito is the same. Papito is is like Navia. So when him and Navia link up, they're producing, they're using melodies, they're, they're sampling weird things. You know, I'm just like, are you guys done? Okay, here's my verse. You know, which is always, it's, just, it's always been like that though.